everyone got someone but me. I got you. Why? What's wrong with me? The show is about the AIDS crisis in New York City in the 1980s and how it impacts specific members of the gay community. I think it's a really important show to um, bring to the University of Arkansas campus. The cast is amazing. The cast is just uh, one of the best casts I've ever been in. You had no right to do that. Oh, did we violate your rights? Well, yes, sort of. You know, the days of us on the phone when we get on with somebody in the back of us, but it's not for you. This is a new look even for you. I want you to tell Fire that I Half of the cast from part one is coming back to reprise their roles. I think the most unique thing for me in this process playing the angel is having the chance to get to work with two different directors on the role and getting to work with their separate interpretations of the character. It's fun to kind of take the ideas that were kind of explored in part one and kind of blow them up and present them in a new way. Come with me to the hospital over to room 1013. I will show you America. Terminal, crazy, and mean. It's a really insane and weird play, but it's probably one of the smartest things that was written about the AIDS epidemic. And it's nice to be able to come see a show where you learn a lot of heartfelt values, but you get to laugh at the same time. It's a darn good story. <laughs> it's so enthralling and so, so, um, it's funny, and then it's sad, and then it's funny, and then it's really funny, and then it's really, really, really funny, and then it's really sad. And it'll take you on an emotional roller coaster that, that is unmatchable by any play out there. <laughs>